church remembers Leo the Great, Bishop of Rome, teacher of the faith. Leo the Great became Pope in the year 440 and twice proved his bravery in saving the citizen, of citizens of Rome from the invading barbarians. He was an eloquent and wise preacher, using simple gospel text to proclaim the Christian faith. His administrative skills were unrivaled and he used the resources of the church for the good of the people. Rather than further confuse Christians by entering into the controversy over the person of Christ, Leo spoke simply of the humility of Christ, who is divine and human in his compassion, uniting biblical images in prayer, rather than dividing in debate. Leo died on this day in the year 461. God our Father, who made your servant Leo strong in the defence of the faith, fill your church with the spirit of truth, that guided by humility and governed by love, she may prevail against the powers of evil, through Jesus Christ your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. So we give thanks for the life of Leo the Great, and for all those who teach theology and write spiritual books. And may the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be upon you and remain with you.